Hi guys and welcome back to Sparajo Madrid. My name is Daniela. I'm showing you three bedrooms today in a 10 bedroom apartment in the very center of the city. Come with me. Okay guys, we're standing by the front door and as you can see we have this tile floor and we can go this way or that way. Right here we have some clothesline for drying the clothes and over here there's some rooms but right now they're all unavailable. So let's check out the available rooms. If we go through here, we're going to available room number one. This is room number six, right here. We have this um, double bed right here. It's between a single and a double, I guess. We have the a closet. Let's open it up and check it out. Pretty spacious closet, as you can see. We have a rack over here, some shelving here, and of course, some space above it to put your bags and whatnot. And we also have a nightstand right here for you know, some other personal things that you can put with this really nice top. And we have this window that goes to an inner patio. So it's actually very, very quiet We're in the middle of the day and everything feels really quiet in here. So we move back and we can check out the kitchen. This is a common area. So you can see it's quite the large kitchen right here. We have a table here with some chairs that you can use to eat your meals. We have fridge over here and a fridge over there. We have some pantry space over here. Let's check out this other fridge. So pretty large fridge. And we also have all this space here for your cooking. We have four gas stoves. We have the oven and a microwave. And we also have, you know, drawers for cutlery and other cooking situations right here. We have more storage space over here. And I believe they're separated by a room number, so you would each get some pantry space. Over here we have the kitchen sink and the washing machine and a um, dishwasher, which is very nice because that way you don't have to do the dishes all the time. So, a lot of pantry space, you know, designed for each of you. And we have everything you need. And this also has this large windows right here that go to the same inner patio. So we keep walking. And we check out here this bathroom number one. This is the largest of all the bathrooms. As you can see, quite spacious. It looks like a, an entire room. And we have the toilet, the bidet. We have a full tub over here with uh, also a removable shower head so you can use it as a regular shower. Over here we have a lot of space for, you know, storage and toiletries and whatnot, as well as over here, and a big mirror. And we so also have some space down here. If we turn around, we can see that we have some closet space over here that can be used for storage for your own bathroom needs. Over here. Okay, so let's check out this giant bathroom from this side. Right here. Okay, we keep walking. This was the hallway, so you, you don't have to go through the kitchen to get here. And then we go through this hallway. We have a little space over here to, for storage. We keep walking and we reach bathroom number two. This, uh, this bathroom just doesn't have a, a shower, it's just a toilet and a sink, as we see here. But you have space to get ready, put on your makeup and whatnot. And we have this really nice tiling over here, as you can see. So let's check it out. Close the door. This would be bathroom number two. If we check out over here, let's see if there's lights. We have a trastero, so, you know, please to keep stuff. And then over here we have bathroom number three. Bathroom number three does have a shower. So there are two showers in the apartment. We have a bidet, we have a toilet, and over here we have the sink. Again, plenty of space around it to keep your things. We have a mirror and we have some storage space under here. 
And there's also, this is actually for the heating, but you can also use it, you know, for some storage. So, this is bathroom number three. We keep walking, and we reach the two other available rooms today. We have room number nine, which is over here. A bit more spacious than the other room that we were showing, room number six. This has a big double bed, and as you can see, we have plenty of space around to work with. And over here we have a desk with a chair for some space. And if we open this a little bit, we get to see the view, which is also of an inner, inner patio, and you have your clothesline right there as well. So let's check out the room from this side. Quite spacious. This is bedroom number nine. Let's check it out from this side. You have a hamper here as well. Right there. And last but not least, oh, and a full length mirror. What's up? And a full length mirror. And we also have a closet here. Let's check it out. So, good place to keep some things. It's, of course, the shared closet because it's in the hallway. And over here we have bedroom number 10. Pretty spacious as well. We have the a big double bed over here. If we turn around, we can see we have these shelving right here. A full-length mirror again. And we have a desk right here with some drawers that you can use. And a table right here. And the view is the same as, ooh, my camera adjust, as bedroom number nine. So this inner patio. Let's check out the room from this side. Like so. And that will be it, you guys. Well, guys, that was it for today. I really hope you liked it. See you next time. Bye.